Greetings, everyone. This is Liminality Carp, and it's time for us to infiltrate this castle. And by infiltrate, I mean immediately head over here because... Ah, uh, that didn't go exactly where I wanted it to. But we have our first Moonstone. Now, one thing... Ah, uh, that might blast the wrong way. Yeah, it did. One thing to note with uh, the way I'm trying to get this one is you have to be a little careful. That is going to blast... Like that. If you don't stand correctly, it blasts out of the room and you then have to come over here and repeat everything that I just did. Also, you don't actually have to throw a bomb up there to start with. Oh, there we go. That actually worked. You don't have to throw a bomb up there to blow up that crate. You can hit it with your hammer. Also, uh, enjoy this music that kind of gives me like a Pink Panther vibe. Also... Uh, red turrets, or orange I should say. Orange turrets hurt. They're suicide turrets. So, keep them at arm's length. Thankfully, if you blast them into each other, they can take each other out. One thing to note as well, I'm kind of going to be doing this one slightly blindish. As opposed to what I had previously been doing, where I'd be planning things out. The reason for that is... Well, we'll get there when we get to the main part of this area, and basically, I want to explore with everyone. Also, uh, that crate is moving. Ah! Whew, you're not one of them. Try not to be alarmed, but there's evil afoot. As far as I can tell, it's an invasion of body snatchers. If they catch you, they'll turn you into a mean, mindless bully. The exit is blocked, and all my friends have been taken over. Now that you understand the situation, I suggest you go hide. Wait a minute. How did you get in here? Why have you come? Lightcaster duties. Never heard of lightcasters, but it sounds awesome! Captain Max did say to wait for reinforcements. This must be the time. I can help you open the locks with my security clearance. There have to be others hiding just like me. Take me to the main terminal. It's a room with, comp with computers located at the center of this jail. You can't miss it. And we have obtained a person. Also, we now have new guards. They are... Basically going to be like the Ouroboros bandits of this area. In fact, they even have very similar behavior. Except for the camera, you know, being mean there. Oh, wow, I've taken a lot of damage already. But yeah, they are very similar. Also, hey, bard picture. But just to show, we have an A, a C, a B, and a crown door. We can only go through this computer door, however. Which is apparently being guarded. Oh, they've got double crossbows. Their double crossbows are better than mine. I just have a single crossbow. Man. We need a double crossbow. There we go. But just get it so you hit them both and abuse the fact that we have all the stamina and... Ooh, we got a macaroon. Ooh, and it also opened up this side. We made it to the main terminal. You're just full of surprises, aren't you? As you can see, this jail is high tech. With my handprint, I can grant you a level C key card. As a security measure, this key card only allows a limited number of unlocks. After which, you have to return to this terminal to replenish the key card's permissions. We got five. And I can only do that. And only I can do that, so I'll wait here. Don't worry about me. We'll escape together after you're done. Right? Yep. Of course. Also, uh, that right there revealed a songstone. Written by this, written by a songstone in tiny letters. Difference. So, what that means is, what we're trying to find is basically, uh, these books are giving you the hint. You're trying to find out which ones 
look different between the left and the right. So, in the upper left one, we have a green with two stripes. Over here, we have a green with one stripe. And that's basically what you're trying to do. So it looks like it is green, red, blue. You know what? Let me actually just... Green, red, blue. Uh, green, red, blue. Green is the same. Purple's the same, green's the same, purple's the same. Uh, blue again. Blue again. Uh, purple, which is that. Red looks good. Yellow. And there we go. And it opens up this treasure vault with our second moonstone. Now, let's go use that key card. And also realize that we now have new people. Thankfully, if it is a platform that you cannot jump through, their arrows also cannot go through it. And uh, just combo them. Wait for a safe point to get in and combo them, stun lock them combo so that they do not shoot you. Also as a note, if I come up here, we get a uh, noise. But we can use keycard C to open this. And we're just going to immediately refill. Because I'm pretty sure once we open that door, it uh, stays open. However, there are other doors coming up that will not stay open. So we're going to be going back and forth to get multiple key cards. Each of these doors will require a key card. And unfortunately, once you open it once, it, it eats up that key card. And you basically no longer have access to it. But just to show, we come through here, and we ended up up top. So that's basically the trick to this area. You need to make good use of your uh, key cards and not get... Uh, not get that. Not get that. Let's eat a cannoli. We need some health. All right, you know what? We'll just eat all these cannolis. We're back to 65. And you're down there, and I don't care about you anymore. Now, thankfully, they will have some open doors so that you can try to see, okay, well, where do I want to go? Looks like we want to go to the far right door and to the middle door. So, let's deal with this annoying guy first. Okay, you... You took up all my cannoli! And you didn't even give me something nice back. And some more Rin. Which, again, more Rin is not bad. So, onwards we go! I think we're down to... One, two, three, four. I think we have one grade C key card left. Thankfully, the key cards are uh, key items, so they don't actually take up an inventory slot. Also, those things will just eventually explode, as you could probably tell by the beep, 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 beep. And, okay, let's see how many of those in cards we actually have. Yeah, we only have one key card left. So we've got to be careful, or I've got to go back and get more key cards. Looks like I might... In theory, it looks like it should just be the upper right. There is some stuff down there in the middle, which we might get later. But let's just do the upper right for now, so that we get our progress forward. Yeah! Phew. For a moment there, I thought my time had come. I see. So you're mounting a rescue operation. Well, allow me to assist. We need to get this jail back in order, or I won't be able to pay my rent. I can provide you with level B key card, with a level B key card if you escort me to the main terminal. And now, we just take care of these guys because we can. Yeah, that's right, run. You're going to shoot me, I'm going to beat you with a bat. But we now need to head all the way back because we need some key cards again. I'm going to go get the stuff that was back over there in the middle drawer 
But before we do that, let's bring this guy over here, get some level B key cards, and restock on level C. Ooh, she's very happy that he's here. Here you are, a level B key card, as promised. Got five level Bs. I'll wait here so I don't slow you down. Give him heck! Hi, how goes the... You know what? Let's say going swell. Let's see what actually happens. That's what I like to hear. Go get him, champ! You're not just saying that to make me feel better, are you? I need some level C permissions. Nothing to report. How can I be of assistance? Tell me what you know. Now that you mention it, two weeks ago they made a scour the whole dungeon. We were told to report on any strange objects, and when they, they wouldn't even tell us what to look for. Things deteriorated soon after that. They blocked the exits and had all of us interrogated separately. Luckily, I wised up and hid. No one thinks to search a jail cell. You know, I would have expected that they would have searched the jail cells. But now, let's just go the correct path and see what is over here. Do not shoot me. Okay, good. The door made it so they couldn't shoot me. And this is just the far right. I don't need to actually check that one. Now, one thing to note is that coming up, they will be chain they will be playing with our perspective, so to say. Also, if you fall down, you have to use another key card, so don't fall down. Ooh! Some house soup! Let's see what the house soup does. Where is the house soup? There it is! Expertly crafted soup, made by country rich flavors of apparel stock and finely chopped vegetables through a long simmering... Okay, the key point is that it is a fast eat for a nice little chunk of health, but I'm going to eat this first. Because it takes longer. There's nothing in this room. Okay, that's honestly the only reason I went into 1-3. We want 1-2 to get ourselves some pookie jerky and... That's about it. Just pookie jerky. Now, let's head back and go through the B-side. Sushi? They gave me sushi. Okay. Well, that's the A-side. B-side's over here. And just like before, once we use it a B key card, we're going to immediately get it restocked. Restore those permissions. Sure, we'll restore level C. Admittedly, after you finish the seaside, you don't need to restore them again. But I like having them on hand, just in case I decide to go back for any reason. Like, maybe wanting more pookie jerky? Now, this is where I was mentioning of they're going to start playing with your perspective. We went in here, we went in the far right, but we're on the far left. So, just be ready. Whereas now, it's going to flip on the horizontal axis. Well, flip across the vertical axis. It's going to flip around. That's what I'm trying to say. I don't know if there's anything in these boxes. Ooh, Pero Egg. Well, we'll go get that. We won't get that because I am... Inventory full. Just fall down, please. There we go. Now I don't have to worry about you. I have to worry about these people, but... So I want the door directly above me. Thankfully, these... First areas... Sorry for the pause there. I thought I was going to get shot. Are relatively simple. Okay, good, good. That worked nicely. Oh, beautiful! That was a great bomb throw. Also, take note of that thing directly above Gale. We will be coming back here eventually for it. Oh, good. Good, good, good. Now, we have... How many bees do we have left? We have... Three bees left. And we've got four levels of doors to go through. And uh, there's an energy gem up there. So it looks like we want the one 
of up and left two to get into that. And is there any other... Nope. So we want three two, it looks like. To get that energy gem. We're going to charge this up. Well, that didn't work for me. That's really not working for me. There we go. All right, anyway, three two, because uh, we can't get into three three. However... If you notice, on 3-2, there's a bottom of a wall. And it looks like we actually will go into 2-2, two, because two, there's some more food down there for us. Why did I pick up a bomb? I don't know why I picked up that bomb. Anyway, let's actually eat some food. Uh, that puff pastry... You know, that soup's better than the puff... Oh, I'll... All right. Anyway, I am indecisive. We're eating this puff pastry. Because we kind of need some health. And you know what? We'll eat the fish skewer as well. It's another good bit of health and gives us another inventory slot open. And we're at 6 to 9. Anyway, into 2-2. Two, two, and this will also let us see the rest of this half. So we want down and... We want 1-1 one, one, it looks like. And... Oh, that's a good thing. So yeah... You want to come into 2-2. It's got some honey brew for you. And uh, there will eventually be a boss fight that we will make use of that. I didn't run in time. There we go. Anyway, into 1-2. And I think that is our last B key. I wanted 1-1. One, one. I wanted 1-1. One, one. Do I have a B key card? I am out. All right. Be right back. Alright, we've got 1-1 one, one open. Let's get this person who's... Looks like she's been in here for a while. Hey! You frightened me! I thought you were one of them! I've been hiding in here, waiting for the right time to plan an escape. As you can see from the markings on the wall, I've been waiting quite a while. Each of these tallies represents a minute! Furthermore, I've missed counting a minute here and there, so take these tallies and double it! No need to feel sorry for me. I'm quite tough. So, are you part of an ongoing breakout operation? Count me in. I can get you, well, I can get you level A key card. I can get you at the main terminal. Something with that is reading weirdly to me. But regardless, we now have the next person to get over to the A side of this area. So, we are now heading all the way back to the main terminal. Ignore those guys. They're just going to beep and eventually explode. Like, it's kind of weird that they have all these self-destructing bomb turrets inside the cells. Like, I don't want to be a prisoner in this dungeon. Like, I want to be a prisoner in dungeons in general, but... If my superior knew I was giving this to a, civil to a civilian, I'd lose my job. I'll hang with these two and hold down the fort. Be careful out there. Well, before we do that, uh, give me some more level B permissions because we're going to need them later. Hey, what can I do for you? Tell me what you know. You saved me just in the nick of time. I sure to think what would have what of what happened to my friend. They held him down and put this strange device on his head. Then, zap! He became one of them! They all appeared to be following orders of a strange hooded man wearing a dog's mask. Even just a glance at him gave me goosebumps all over. Take caution if you run into him. Well, we now know what the mastermind looks like, I guess. It's time to head up to the A-Ward. And get our fifth A key card back because as always we're going to need it. Now then, what is on A deck? I missed that sprint jump. Anyway, what is on A deck? We have a save point. We're going to make use of it. And we just immediately start on an area with two levels. And lots of choices. 
Uh, above me doesn't look bad. In fact, above me looks like the only good choice. So we're going to try to get to... Ah, that's the key. So if you notice, there's no way to actually get up a level. So we have to go one to our right. So that we can climb up. And if you see... Ah, two to the right from here is another shaking box. So we probably want to go in there. We also want one to the left. Because that has a uh, climbable thing. But we're going over here first. You're a shaking box. <laughs> Can it be? My knight in shining armor. Remember Ruby? We saved her from the Ouroboros before. Don't you remember? It's me, Ruby. After I left bounty hunting, I decided to become a guard. How hard can it be, right? Oh, how wrong I was. I've stumbled into some evil and nefarious plot. Luckily, no one thinks to look inside a box inside the jail cell. Thanks for saving me again. Except this with my gratitude. We got a moonstone. Well, no more reason to hang around here. Look out, world. Here I come. Oh, we will find Ruby again later. But the only thing we really do, it looks like, is go into this thing. Because it had another ladder up. And uh, there didn't appear to be anything on the other sides. Ah, that's just one Rin. I don't need one Rin that badly. And uh, this thing going all, ow, all the way across is what we needed to get over to here. And with that, the music is stopped. So I'm sure you can guess what this means. Charge up. And it is bat boss, well, mini boss battle time, I should say. Nope. Nope. Oh, I am surprised that I, ow, dodged those arrows, honestly. Oh, nice run, guy. Ow, ow, ow. You know what? Let's deal with you. Deal with you. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Great, more crossbows. I don't need crossbows. In fact, I need anti-crossbows. I need to heal. We're going to take this fish steak and try to get to a point where I can heal. Or not. I'll see you all back here in a second. Oh, good, good, good. Just one crossbowman left. For now. So, as a... Uh, as a note, apparently... Killing certain ones actually spawns the others. And hey, we're done with this set now. Also... That was a dog. Welcome to the kobolds! They... Throw grenades and they teleport around. And they've got a... They've got blaster. Each time you hit them, though, they're going to blast around. So crossbow's not a bad thing to use. Neither is the concentration technique. That is honestly going to be very useful. Hey, and we got a doggy biscuit. Well, let's see what is over this side and break the boxes because we can. What is over here? Hey, it's more people. That was incredible. The way you weave left and right, and then pow, right in the kisser. I wasn't sure whether to cheer or cry. They are my friends after all. Thanks for saving us. Any later, and we would have been brainwashed. Step aside, important friend coming through. Hey, it's Thomas. Yeah, just face I want to see. And Bart, my best alien friend. Speaking of aliens, what's with that weird dog-looking one just now? Are they- are these the evil invaders you told us about? I don't think so. The one Gale just fought is a kobold. On the galactic stage, they made a name for themselves as professional mercenaries. Which means someone paid them to be here. But for what? Let's just hope they're not after what I think they're after. 
Pardon the interruption. I am Sir Max, loyal servant to the Prince. Our intelligence informed us that the Prince was being held atop the tower. I led a small team to attempt a rescue. Sadly, my presence in this cell speaks of the result. However, seeing the way you sit upon those mind control guards rekindles all my hope. Which I put a word in there that wasn't there. If we were to fight together, we would surely succeed. Yeah, please, help us save the prince. We beg of you. I don't know. Just say I will. I believe if you say no enough here, you actually will get a game over screen. And I don't want to have to fight that battle again. Oh, thank you. This is a good oppor this is a good opportunity. I do need to see your country's leader after all. He has knowledge instrumental to saving the world. And I've got a scar to settle. Nobody puts me in jail. With this, with this jailbreak, they'll be sure to heighten security. Which is why now is the time to strike. We'll set out immediately. We'll rally our forces out of hiding to create a diversion. With their attention elsewhere, you'll be able to climb the towers. Knights to arms! There's a lift at the top to the left of the main terminal. That lift will take you to the base of the towers. We will wait for you there. Before you go, I got something for you. I call it the Sonic Spear. It's a weapon I was, thro I was throwing together based on the materials I had on hand. The spearhead resonates at a frequency that lets it vibe into solid material. It'll cut through wood and stone, though metal is still a work in progress. If you hadn't shown up when you did, I'd be using it to attempt a breakout. Luckily, there's no need for that now. You can take it. We obtained the Sonic Spear. Thomas says it can pierce most solid surfaces. Once a spear is embedded in a wall, it can act as a makeshift platform. This is a very, very important item, which I need to equip and find a good slot for it. Uh, slingshot, you are getting moved down over there, and we'll just pull out the broken crank lamp when we need a spark. Eesh, mind controlled sh soldiers, these kobolds are, are packing serious technology. Which reminds me, our ancestors also weaponized mind control during the Great War. It's one of their more controversial deeds. For once, the Peace Ministers and I will agree that sub-technology should stay buried. So, beware! There's no telling what else the Kobolds might have up their sleeves! I'm no good on front lines, but here this place has a main terminal. Maybe I can do some damage there. Well, here's- oh, hi! Other people over here. I'm no soldier. I'm in here for thievery. Finally, chance to try again! Well, living righteously, that is. Of course, well, we just let the thief out. Uh, huh? W what's going on? My friends have gone to fight. Oh no, I better hurry. They're useless without me. All right, well, we have now saved everyone from these prison cells. It's now time for us to head out, and we can't make it. However, with our new trusty spear, we can head on out. We don't need to worry about that anymore. We can just jump right on over, and we're actually going to head on to the B side to get that area I was pointing out earlier. Also, if you notice, uh, this area, the King's area, is now all automatically open because they opened it up for us. Now, unfortunately, you do still need to use the key cards for some of these. You can't just use the Sonic Spear everywhere because some of these don't let you actually jump high enough. Also, uh, the Sonic Spear is a weapon. You can use it to attack these guards. So make good use of that. Nope, you're not shooting me again. And I just don't want to deal with you. I'm just going to avoid you. And now, okay, we have to deal with these ones. Just because I got too close and woke it up. As a note, you can only have two spears on screen at a time. However, 
climb on up here, and lo and behold, yet another moonstone. Also, you can jump through the Sonic Spears. Now, let's head. Oh, do not hit me. Do not hit me. Do not hit me. It got me. Well, as I was trying to say, we're going to head on through up to the, uh, through the, what do you call it? This door. Through this door here. Because, you know, they opened it up for us. Oh, I didn't realize the platform was down here. I should have, but I didn't. Well, let's talk to them. We had a few unfortunate cases of friendly fire. I guess that's expected when everyone's wearing the same armor. Oddly, I have yet to see the enemies commit the same mistakes. Alright, well, what do you have to say? It's a mess up there. They fell upon us in an instant. They're sure to increase their defenses if we fail. This might be the only chance we've got. Sir Max said we had a new star fighter that could really go the distance. I wonder if he's handsome. I don't know. I think, I think it looks decent. Also. Shoot that. And if you remember. Uh. Actually, we haven't been over here yet. There's a heart ruby over there. We can't get that yet. Pretty sure we should have been over here, though, because over here we go. This is where we dealt with the light casters. It's been a while. I almost thought you turned tail and ran. Others had to return to their official duties, so I alone will confirm that you finished the initiation. So, we well, you say you got a good feel for the Aqualon. Did it speak to you? I... That's what we like to hear. You passed. The key thing we look for in a light caster is fearlessness. Most people see a dark corridor and they avoid it, but not you. Welcome to the light casters. May your patrol shine bright. You now get free access to the Aqualine. And the owner of the Blue Lobster will also give you some discounts. That's all for now. It's great to have a fellow light caster who's my age. I guess I'll return to my usual haunt. My news should be done by now. Yep, so we now have an easy way into the castle. If you want to, say, go out, get some healing items, maybe buy some equipment with the money you got from inside the castle. However, there's more over here. Gentler, super effective. Ugh. This man saw something before he, before he was knocked out. He's just speaking gibberish now. That uh, food gives stomach pain. Well, naturally, everyone knows that. Now, you do want to head over here. Not just because you can get yourself a raw bird and, you know, boxes to break. But more importantly, we have this. And also more boxes to break. This gives you a back entrance into the castle. And a back exit out if you need as well, I'm not going to get that guy. And a campfire to cook things like that raw bird. To get here, though, you actually go into the back of Dea. And enjoy your back entrance into the castle. And also, if you want some mystery meat, you can pick it up here. With that, we will be ending things here. Next time, we're actually going to make a quick detour over to a tie. Now that we have a spear to actually get our new spear technique, and then we'll be heading up the towers. As always, thank you all very much for watching, and take care.